Hello, welcome to Just One More Story Farm. Today it's raining. So today we're gonna answer your questions about chickens and rain. Do chickens like the rain? Should they go out in the rain? Should they have access or should they be locked in the coop when it's raining? Are their feathers actually weatherproof? These are some of the questions that ran through my head when I was starting with chickens and certainly things that maybe you're questioning as well. So let's explore those answers today. Let's go consult with the chickens. One, two, one, two, three, four. Do you want to farm? A wicked awesome farm. Watch this channel to learn what to do. We love to farm and we'll show you. Yeah. Welcome to our show. Good morning! Hello ladies and gentlemen! Got a rainy day today! Anybody want to come out in the rain? How about you? For you? Boys? Kaden, do chickens like the rain? Um, no. I mean, yes. Kaden, do chickens go out in the rain? They do. Yeah. I take all my stuff to go out here. Let's go see if we can find the rest of the flock. Let's go take a walk. They're out free ranging. Are you forgetting something? What are we forgetting? To check for more eggs. Oh yes, we'll check for eggs too. Chicky babies. Hi babies. What do you think of the rain? chickens do go out in the rain they have the option we do give them full free ranging options in the rain in our experience we do find that they don't like to go out in the heavy wind and heavy rains but if it's just a light rain like it is now they will go out in it and they are scratching around What do you ladies and gentlemen think of this rain? Most of you look quite dry. Oh, <laughs> 
You guys want a little lettuce snack? It's been raining here all morning on the farm and overall they've been in and out into the coop out of the coop they seem to just be doing their usual routine of coming in and out having breakfast inside the coop then coming out and hanging out in the rain for a bit as you saw from their feathers they don't look wet feathers below the down feathers are not waterproof so I find that in pouring rain and high winds they're found in the coop they're not interested in coming out in the heavy rains but if it's just drizzling or just a light rain and it's not super windy then they'll come out in it they actually especially in the summertime summer rains you'll see them digging and looking for bugs right ladies <laughs> hi handsome how you doing t-bone Let's go see what the cockerels think of the rain. Good morning. <laughs> no. These cockerels I saw were out all morning in the rain. They did not go back into the coop. So they actually look a little bit more wet than the hens that were going in and out. But honestly, they seem comfortable. They don't seem cold. It's actually not a cold day today. It's uh, strange weather for January. We had freezing cold this week and now today it's rainy and it's actually almost feels warm. I don't even have a jacket or a hat or gloves today, which is strange. But they seem to be enjoying the fact that it's not super cold and they can just be out and not have freezing temperatures. <laughs> so you'll see these outer feathers do look and feel a bit wet here. But underneath, if we look, their down is perfectly dry. So these feathers are doing a great job of keeping him nice and dry. It's repelling the water and keeping it off of their down feathers underneath. Thank you for letting me check, Ferdinand. All right, Templeton, let me check. Let's see, so we've got some wet feathers here. Now look under your wing. Oh, nice and dry under there. Thank you for letting me check. How's your little feet? They're a little wet. Cool. Oh, you found my ring. Oh, you found my ring. Shiny things, huh? Yeah, shiny things. I know. Henry, how are you doing? You actually don't look as wet as your brothers, but your feet are quite pink. But I can see you're dry underneath. So 
So it is important with chickens that you give them access so they can get out of the rain and are able to get into shelter because you certainly don't want the down feathers getting wet if they were in rain for a prolonged period of time. So having that access to shelter is important. Buff Orpingtons are a very hardy breed so I'm able to allow them to make the decision whether they want to go out or not and not have to worry so much about that as long as they have shelter, plenty of food, plenty of water and are able to get out of the elements quickly and easily. I like to make sure they have lots of options as well for shelter. With my Buff Orpingtons the only time I do restrict their access is when they're chicks somewhere between six to eight weeks i find it's closer to that eight week mark with these buff warpington breeds i like to make sure that they are fully feathered out before i give them access to the elements like rain or snow but they always 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 have to have a place to go that's dry and out of the wind that is very very important but overall i would say they don't love the rain but they do like that especially in the summertime the rain brings out the bugs i wouldn't say that they love puddles either they seem to actually avoid the puddles they don't seem to like getting their feet wet overall the rain doesn't appear to stop them from doing their everyday activities they seem to still go out and roost in the same spots and hang out and they still free range so I say give them access, let them make their decision, let them be chickens and enjoy it, but certainly keep an eye out and make sure that it is safe for them. I certainly don't think it's dangerous for them as long as they do have access to shelter. What do you boys think? Gonna hang out all day in the rain? This is where you guys like to hang out, right? You're always perched up on the pallet fences. You like to be up high so you can see all the action, see the ladies free ranging. Right? I know. <laughs> Birdman likes the lettuce. Templeton, you want some? Oh, Templeton's trying it. <laughs> Maybe it's you like when Calliope feeds you. <laughs> if you liked this video, please hit the like button. If you would like to see more videos like this, please hit that subscribe button. We're also gonna make a video about whether goats like the rain and questions about goats in the rain. So stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching this video and we really appreciate your support. Have a great day. Bye. One, two, one, two, three, four. Now you're learning to farm like me. There is so much more to see. If you're planning on heading elsewhere, burn you, yeah, yeah, yeah. This really is the place to be. Well,